going on and welcome back to the Blake Film and Mask channel and today we're doing our first spirit Halloween tour of the year I'm here with my two nieces as we're going to do our first trip of the year we'll be walking in here and seeing what all they got out I doubt we'll have a whole lot of stuff set up but at the end if I end up picking anything up I'll let you guys know but I'll turn around and let you guys enjoy what's going on hey Aubrey check out this leather face uh,
Or do you want to come back and actually get those at one point?
And as you guys can see, we're back at my house. And uh, I was actually pleasantly surprised by the selection that the Mansfield Spirit Halloween actually had out. Um, usually when you go very early on in the season, there's usually not a whole lot out. So I was definitely surprised by just the sheer volume of stuff that they actually had out, all the animatronics. There's usually the best part about going to Spirit Halloween is seeing all the new animatronics that they bring out. But like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed that walk through there. I actually have another Spirit Halloween that's a little bit closer than that one. But I'd actually uh, like to do a little walkthrough for a little walkthrough thing for the, uh, the Marion one. If you guys would actually like to see that one as well. If I can get my words out. That one, in my opinion, is usually a slightly little better Spirit Halloween than the Mansfield one. So definitely hope to check that one out very, very soon. I think they're finally open as well. But I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I got. This is actually a, a pretty cheap little trip. I had to fix the AC, you know, for my house. So I didn't have too much funds to really go too all out. Maybe when, if I do the, the Marion one. But I'll go ahead and show you guys what I got. And at the end of the video, I'll give you guys the close-up shots of all the different pieces that I did buy. But first up here is this... Uh, ghost face bling mask and uh i actually think this piece is actually super cool especially if you like shiny things and uh fun fact actually about this mask this mask is actually seen in the new stream movie stream six and it's a very brief brief cameo blink and you kind of miss it type of deal i believe this mask is seen in the subway scene i'm pretty sure yeah, I'm fairly certain it was like the subway scene. I think you actually get to see this piece here. But I actually did see this in the stores and uh, before going over to Spirit City Online and whatnot. And I think this is honestly a pretty super cool mask. Like I said, it's just, it's like it's just a hard plastic mask that they're calling the, the ghost face bling mask. But I think this is actually a pretty rad piece. And I just overall I do like the way it looks. And then uh, end up picking up this... Uh, Killer Clowns from Outer Space Shorty Mask. Uh, I was glad to still see that they were still doing these this year. I meant to pick these up last year and end up uh, passed on them for whatever reason. But uh, it kind of bums me out that the Jumbo Mask is in a costume only deal. But I think this is actually a pretty uh, decent uh, mask here. It's just plastic vacuum formed. And I think they actually just right out of the factory. I actually think these are pretty good mask especially just for 20 bucks like i said cheap little trip but i do get like killer clowns from outer space it's actually one of my all-time favorite uh horror comedy movies if you will i just think it's one of the best of its kind and especially the just the concept of some silly goofy looking clowns from outer space coming coming down and turning everybody into cotton candy cocoons or whatnot is just really kind of ingenious in its, of itself but like i said i actually think that's one of the best uh horror comedy movies of all time and it's definitely a movie i watch at least once or twice a year but like i said i think they did pretty good with the shorty here i definitely would like to get this out to get it actually repainted and look, to get a little bit more movie accurate but like i said but right out of the store i think they've done a really excellent job which leads you can probably guess the last one, which is the spiky mask, which is another one that I think they did an awesome job right out of the gate with. And it's definitely one of, I think, the best looking ones of, of the Killer Clowns from Outer Space. So definitely happy to add three of these pieces to my collection. Uh, like I said, I'll be giving you guys all up close shots of these. And I really hope that you've enjoyed this uh, little Spirit Halloween tour. Hopefully you guys will be around if I release the uh, one for Mary. But the only thing left is to give you guys some up close shots of these pieces. This has been Blake Billman here at the Blake Billman Master Channel. Reminding you to strive to be masculine. <laughs>